Hello everyone, today we're going to be working on the Rivolino fake, made famous by Brazilian national player Roberto Rivellino. Hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> This is a very effective fake, even more so at the younger ages. So if you're 12 years old and below, you're going to have much more success. If you're a little bit older, the speed in which you exit the fake will determine whether it's successful or not. We start behind the ball and now pretending that we're actually going to pass the ball, we hide the ball by going around it. We have to make that passing motion around the ball to really start selling the fake. Practice your repetitions on this first step. Always on your toes when you're stationary to simulate running. Now we need to bring the other foot close to my first one. This is to prepare the body for the exit. So after I have sold the fake, my second step will prepare my body for my exit. I want my second step to be slightly behind at an angle so my exit is forward at an angle. Once you start to get comfortable with the first two steps, really work on selling the fake by moving your body towards a target. The third and final step will be the exit. I will always in most fakes exit to the outside using the outside of my foot. So I want a strong ankle to guide the ball forward at an angle. Here's a tip. Say the steps out loud. Step, step, touch. Every time you do it, it's step, step, touch. This will really help in the execution of the fake. Step, step, touch. We can always do this stationary at home, going to the left and to the right and just working on going over and the touches. Now let's try it on the dribble. You can still say the steps out loud. As you go, you go step, step, touch and make sure it's a strong touch away from pressure. Stationary repetitions and repetitions while dribbling are very important. Keep saying those steps out loud. Soon as we're comfortable, we're going to start to add pressure. Adding a defender adds pressure to the fake and we're moving closer and closer to executing this fake during a real game. Get comfortable with it, add pressure, apply it on a friend, Execute it in a game and most of all have fun with it.